Hey, yeah, anyway, this is a video of me experimenting with gelatin. I saw some other people using gelatin for special effects makeup, so I decided to give it a try. Anyway, it's gelatin. I got it. Oh, wait. I'm doing this voiceover, by the way, because initially I made it and I made this video in Spanish, so I figured no one will ever understand my Spanish. Okay, obviously I was kidding. He. Anyways, yeah, I got the gelatin, and like, um, it's very cheap. It's a pack of four. So one pack of four is only about two dollars plus. Yeah, so over here I'm gonna put it in a cup and then I'm gonna pour in um, some hot water. Yeah, just a little bit. Yeah, if you put a bit too little, it will be a bit clumpy like that. As I found out. <laughs> yes, so add it in more water. And in the end it turned out to be a bit too runny. But what the heck, I applied it anyway to my right. Oh yeah, the expression was because it smells weird. Yeah, anyway, I applied it on my right cheek. I mean the runny one. And I sit, sit, sit it out for a while for it to thicken. And then once it's thickened a bit, I applied it on my left cheek. And there it is. Yeah, I just applied it. I know, it looks disgusting. It smells disgusting too. To me la. Yeah. And then huh, after that, I'll just sit it out again, wait for it to dry. Yeah, once it's dried, it's still sticky to the touch actually. So I'll have to powder it with um, powder. I use translucent powder. Once it's powder, it actually feels like real skin really, which is good in this case. Ugh, yeah. And then, yes, yeah, you can see I do my work on my makeup really fast, right? Huh. And then blah blah blah. And then I cover it with foundation. But actually, as I was saying, no, I didn't say it. But anyway, this um, if you are intending to use this like for like zombie makeup, you can actually just use face paint, gray or whatever, right? Yeah. Right now, I'm adding on color. It's this color is called Ultra. It's from uh, it's a super color from Creole and means grease paint. Yeah. So I just tap it into place until I'm satisfied. And then once I'm satisfied, I'll be using blue. It's also the same kind of paint. Grease paint, super paint from Creolin. Just a little bit here and there. Okay, tap, 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 tap. Okay, once I'm done, I'll add in, um, well, that's a stipple or stipple brush, whatever you want to call it. Okay, I'm using black. It's the same kind of paint, just that it's in a bigger pen. Yeah, so I added that in, tap into place. Yeah, I'm only going to be doing it on one side because I'm too lazy to do the other side. Yeah, so now, ta there it is, disgusting skin. Okay. Oh, I'm gonna add in, what am I gonna do? Um, hmm. Okay. I guess I'll just, I'm touching up and stuff. Oh, there you have it. Disgusting skin. Yeah. So after this, I wanted to try something else just to see how it works. You just want to see how it peels and stuff. So I'll make it look like peeling skin, hanging skin, or not skin, flesh. Oh, there it is. That's like um, whatever that's left behind in the cup. It's so disgusting. Yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna cut it with my sapatula. Otherwise, no, a spatula. Whatever. Yeah, so I'm just gonna make an incision. Gee, like, like, operation like that. Yeah, so I'm gonna just um, pull it. Yeah, it, it peels very well. Yeah, once you have that, and then you, you would wanna paint on the inside. I used a red pen stick. Actually, it's paint stick, but I don't know, I guess they all call it pen stick now. I'm just gonna paint on the inside red and then as you can see it's a bit too bright so later on I added in the color ultra which is like purplish blue oh, sorry purplish red yeah with a stipple brush just tap it into place yeah just give a bit of a dimension to it and then I'm gonna uh, what I'm gonna make it less harsh and then now I'm gonna add in the blood, the fake blood. It's from uh, Creolin also. Yeah. Yeah, that's two sizes, 50ml and 100ml. Yeah. So 
So I'm just gonna edit using the brush. And you're almost there, almost done. Yeah, same. So this is a really, really cheap alternative to some other so-called professional um, special effects products. Yeah. You can actually check out some of the videos of people who use gelatin, some like those Hollywood ones. Oh my god, you should really check it out. So this is just an attempt of using gelatin. I like the effect. Bye! Top scientists on the zombie virus that appeared two weeks ago. They released information saying that the symptoms to watch for are aggression, foaming in the mouth, deterioration of motor skills, and an unbelievable hunger. Be advised that if the infected becomes hostile, the only way to harm them is to shoot them in the head. Okay.